a little while ago, I mentioned my stance on the Ex Libra discussion. I'm all for it, and I really hope that it really works out well. So, in this video, to back up my my stance, if you like, I wanted to give it a try and see how it how it is coming along on FreeBSD. Now, I will prefix this with prefix. I will preface this with one point. All of this is not supported by the FreeBSD project yet. So this is a repository that somebody else has set up. And I just thought I'd give it a, see, a go and, and, and see what it's like and, and if it's ready for prime time just yet. It does state on its on its GitHub page that it is not 100% yet. It's still in alpha. But we're going to go along and have a look at it and see. Okay, now, this is, as I said, this is all based off of somebody else's GitHub page, which is here. And they've got on here two ways of doing this. They've got installing from source, so a ports tree, and they've got installing from packages, and they've got their own package builder here. I thought I'd give it a go with the package builder. Why not? As it's already set up. So let's go to my terminal. There we go. Nice and big. So let's go. Use a local etc. Stop boinging. And as is the way, it's not there just yet. So let's make a package dir and a repos dir. And let's go into it. Okay. And let's create an xlibra.com and post in what it is. There we go. Now I've no idea if this is going to work, but I'm hoping it is. So let's close that out. Now I should, in all theory, just be able to go package install xlibra server and xlibra drivers. Fingers crossed. Well, it's installing. Just for your reference, this is a completely clean environment. It literally only has Pico Alpine installed and Git and now all of this. Yeah, be aware these packages are still in beta stage. Both the ports and the upstream sources, they may not work as expected, may overwrite files, make unicorns come out of your nose or anything in between. <laughs> yes, Libra server has been installed. Yeah, I haven't enabled that. Okay, so it's done. Yeah. So now it's installed, how do you get it to run? Okay, so it is there. So I guess the only way to find out then would be to log in to, from the console with star x. I'm assuming that it uses star x. No, it does not. Okay, quick Google search. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, no, I didn't think it was. Hmm. Well, that's not a good sign. Um, right. So, configure X Libra server. Yeah, this is a bit strange. Okay, um, no screens found. Libra server. Let's have a quick look and see. Okay, let's, let's install the graphics first, shall we? Let's see if that helps. So, because I'm getting the feeling it might be something to do with that. So, package install DRM kmod. Must equals line one pi. Okay. ETC rsu.com. Yeah, we'll just do it that way. This rc minus f ntc rc.com kld underscore list plus equals i 
915. That's three birds. Let's see what happens, because I want to know what happens and why isn't it happening. You'll probably hang there instead. Okay, so that started up all right. No screens. No screens. And ex Libra. Yeah, that's annoying. Yeah, for me, I don't think this is quite ready. Um, there's a lot that needs doing by the looks of it. At least on FreeBSD. Let's get you out of the way, don't need you. And so, let's. Yeah, that, that was silly. Why? Well, I wonder. Should be clean. Hmm, <laughs> interesting. Yeah, that's very interesting, actually. I wonder how long that's going to take. Hopefully not too long. Okay, so just to recap, installing the packages did not work. Okay, that's fine. They're somebody else's packages. I'm not really that surprised. The options probably aren't compatible with my system. Fine going to go through the ports bit and the way that was done was just by following this in instruction here now it does say git clone https baz but that's not right you want github.com forward slash baz forward slash leave the ports let's have a look and see how that works i suspect this will take a while and i'll probably have to come back to it which is no biggie i just would have liked it all done in this video but if it's a two-parter it's a two-parter yeah i'll come back to that in a minute if it okay package delete x libra drivers zero work on never know all right, so these ports are still building. <laughs> this might take a while. In fact, I suspect this will take a very long while. Okay, I'm, I'm going to keep building this. I should have probably done it this way to begin with. Maybe I will. Um, what can you say? I was hoping that I would get a desktop environment up and running by now, but even if it was just a, a window manager of some sort. But we'll come back to it and have a look at it another day. It's nice to know that it's being worked on. It would be nice if it was a little bit further along than this, but I guess that is the, the trade-off that you get with open source, especially ones that are not directly supported by the project that you're using. Time will tell. I'm going to go. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Of course, what will happen now is now that I've stopped, it will finish. Sailor B.